the home this evening after fire erupts at a San Marcos apartment complex. The weather and danger for school children is causing concern for firefighters. KXN's Lauren Landman live at the scene with our top story. Yeah, that's right. Firefighters are still out here actively trying to put out this fire at Champions Crossing Apartments. I'm told the first call for help came out around one o'clock this afternoon. Two and a half hours later, there were still flames coming out of the roof. That's how bad this fire was. Thankfully, it was all contained to building 12, and as far as they can tell, it's a complete loss. The roof is gone, large columns around the building fell to the ground, and firefighters had to break windows on both floors to put out hot spots. Right now, they don't know what caused the fire. I'm told the fire marshal is actively investigating. So far, the city says at least a dozen families will be displaced. In typical situations like this, we do have representatives on site that will come and assist them. So we'll have people here to, to answer questions for them and get them connected with the services they need. There were also some issues with Hay CISD being able to bring all of their students home. 60 of their students live at this apartment complex. They stayed at that school, contacted parents, and the parents had to go and pick them up. Firefighters will remain here on the scene just to make sure that it doesn't reignite. But the big thing that they've been battling all day, all afternoon, is the wind. It just has not let up. And I know that's something you've been tracking for us all afternoon, Jim. Yeah, you're absolutely right. The winds have been gusting over 40 miles per hour at times.